welcome back to the Gourmet Gambit. Nordic black rye bread. A very ancient type of bread. Very consistent, very healthy and more very, very tasty. Delicious with cheese, prosciutto, salmon, smoked salmon. You think of it and it's the perfect match. The one we're going to make today is one with multiple grains, walnuts and cranberries. I'm Urs Wardman. Let's get started. To crack your grains and seeds, you can use the mortar, a rolling pin or a kitchen robot. Before we start, I'm going to put my cast iron pot in the oven, 170 degrees, and I'm going to warm the pot for about 15 minutes. 700 grams of ray grains, 300 grams of spelt grains, Hundred and fifty grams of buckwheat seeds. Hundred grams of oat bran. Hundred and seventy grams of dried cranberries. Two hundred grams of walnut. 2 tablespoons of caraway seeds. We're going to give it a quick swing in the kitchen robot. Just needs to be cracked grossly. We're going to mix the grain and the seeds with the rest of the ingredients, the nuts and the cranberries. One and a half a litre of water, 25 grams of sea salt, three good tablespoons of honey, and we're going to bring this up to the boiling point. Once our liquid is on a good boiling point, we're going to take out our oven pot, put in our grain mixture, and the water with the honey. Give it a very quick stir and then immediately put on the lid. And we're going to preserve our pot in a warm place, room temperature, until the next morning. Minimum 12 hours, the best 24 hours. The next day we're going to work our rye bread and we're going to add our buckwheat flour. We're going to take a good amount of oat flakes and we're going to roll our rye bread in there to cover it up on all sides and we're going to make it look a little bit square at the same time. Aluminum folly. Heat up your oven up to 150 or maximum 160 degrees and we're going to bake our ray bread for 3 hours. Once 3 hours have passed we're going to kill the heat and we're going to let the rye bread cool down in the oven. So once your rye bread is really cooled down we're going to preserve this in the fridge All that's left to say, my dear friends, is bon appétit. I'll see you back soon.